terrifying sequence of events in Queens. This morning, two men on a moped drove down 57th Avenue in Elmhurst. Seconds later, a hatchback barreled into two parked cars and burst into flames. The driver of that hatchback hit and killed the moped riders before he or she ran away. Here's Eyewitness News reporter Sonia Rincon. The moped with two people on it can be seen on surveillance video in the seconds before a car coming the other way smashes into it head on just out of frame. The Volkswagen Golf drags the moped into a parked car, then crashes into another and bursts into flames. You can see the driver of the burning car get out, but then come back, grabbing items from the car as flames and smoke pour out of it and leaving again, this time fleeing the scene for good just as a neighbor appears and makes a call, probably to 911. Another neighbor who called 911 and watched from her home says the sound of the crash and fire truck sirens woke everyone up. First responders arrived to take one person thrown from the moped to the hospital, but the other was pronounced dead at the scene. Firefighters got the flames out and police began their search for the driver who ditched the silver Volkswagen Golf with Illinois plates. The NYPD's collision investigation squad has what's left of the car and is working to identify him. Police tonight say the driver of the Volkswagen failed to negotiate the curve here on 57th Avenue, likely going too fast and taking it too wide, causing him to hit the moped head on. Police still haven't identified the driver or passenger of the moped. It wasn't registered at all. In Elmhurst, Queens, Sonia Rincon, Channel 7 Eyewitness News. Just